Paleontologists are constantly making discoveries that shed new light on their long-standing theories of evolution. The latest, a fossilised crocodile unearthed near the outback town of Isisford in central west Queensland. So did you find this as is, or was it all kind of scattered and you had to do the major jigsaw puzzle thing to put it all together? Well, the initial discovery was by a farmer out at Isisford, and he found these pieces here. And they're all individual blocks scattered through a creek bed, but later worked out that they fitted together. Dr Stephen Salisbury from the University of Queensland spearheaded the painstaking five-year dig, while Kerry Geddes single-handedly prepared the bones back in the lab with an air scribe. It's like a miniature jackhammer, and it's got a vibrating tip and when you push it against the rock, you gently push it against the rock and it shatters a tiny groove. Two and a half years and six and a half kilometres of air scribing later, the ancestor of all our modern day crocodiles came back to life. It's a journey of discovery. Uh, every millimetre of bone that you uncover is, is new to the world. No one's ever seen that before. Until now, scientists believed modern crocodiles originated in Europe or North America, but this skeleton's going to rattle those thoughts for sure. This new discovery that we've made is clearly the most primitive of all modern crocodiles and indicates that the group may have originated in the Australian part of Gondwana and then after that it's rapidly spread up into the Northern Hemisphere. Now make no mistake, crocodiles are not dinosaurs. They roamed the earth and scoured the sea alongside dinosaurs, but are a different beast entirely. And as time would tell, an infinitely more successful one. So we've had crocodiles that lived in the ocean. We've had small ones that ran around on land. We've had gigantic ones. We've had ones that were herbivorous. They've done it all. But the one group that made it through, made it through the extinction that knocked out all the dinosaurs and has persisted today, had its descendants in the animals that we found at Isisford. This is the start of that dynasty.